think it's unusual to be on a listing appointment and come across in your seller's house some minor repairs. The real problem or issue with this is that if you point out the repairs and you don't do it politically correct, you're going to offend them. And then a lot of the good rapport that we built in the front of the listing appointment will be lost because they feel offended. So how do you point it out without really hurting their feelings? My suggestion is to be able to, let's just say for argument's sake, you came across a stain on the carpet. What you want to do when you see the stain is you want to hold for a second, maybe angle yourself from a couple of different directions to kind of examine the stain without saying anything. You got to hold that pregnant pause. It takes a little bit of acting, but the seller will generally step into the conversation and say, do you think we should get the carpet steam cleaned? Now the two word phrase I would recommend here is I would. Anytime you can get the seller to do something that's going to make your life easier, but it's not going to take a lot of time or a lot of effort, that's the objective here. Now, in another case, it may be you'll be standing in the living room and there's a small stain on the ceiling. And if you just take a minute, look at the stain, kind of pause, let the seller into that experience, and generally they will jump the conversation and say, oh, the kids overflowed the tub a couple of weeks ago. Do you think maybe I should touch up the ceiling? And my suggestion is, I would. It's that two word phrase when you want to get somebody to do something to make your life easier. And again, it's about holding that, that pregnant pause, pulling them into the conversation, and letting them make a suggestion and you follow right behind with agreeing.